What I'd like to show today is how to successfully pollinate pelargoniums. This is Pelargonium luteum, one of the geophytic species, and unfortunately this plant requires two specimens to flower at the same time so that they are cross-pollinated. I'll just cross-pollinate the same plant, which will not lead to successful fruit formation. What we need is the following. We need flowers with ripe anthers, and we notice that the anthers are ripe because the powdery substance at the end of anthers is the ripe pollen. We also need a set of flowers with ripe stigmas. And these stigmas are ripe because the anthers have dropped off and the, uh, the stigmas have opened up and are receptive. The first thing we need to do is to air off a ripe anther. And we know that the pollen is ripe because we can brush it off on our fingers. And this is the powdery orange, sometimes yellow substance that can be, that needs to be transferred to another plant, to another flower. I'll tear off another one for the purpose of this video now. This is a slightly fussy part, a part of this work. I've got two anthers on my, in my pincers now, and what I'll do now is just transfer the pollen to another stigma, to a stigma, and brush it off lightly. There's lots of pollen on this stigma, and with any luck, the, the fruit will now set. This is a really, really simple process, and I hope you can do this at home as well. I hope you enjoy this video and that you have a lot of success with your plants. Thank you for watching.